down down left right left right be a start hey, it's not working I'm just gonna highlight for you guys some of my favorite moments from this game uh, one of them is right after you shoot down whatever that thing is and he fires his last little shots off at you this giant robotic spider-like creature or thing mecha comes out of nowhere and just lands on top of you and your partner and the screen is scrolling up it's shooting missiles at you you start to feel claustrophobic because I mean it's there's not much room to move around and you have no idea what's about to happen next And again, the music here is just, just epic. Music, sound effects, I could talk all day about. And then, of course, this moment when you when he finally reveals his true form, and you know, I mean, this, this guy's grinding the ground. You know, that was. I mean, you had no idea that was about to happen. <laughs> I think me and my cousin died twice there. T-1000s when those guys came out we, we, were, we were already excited because we were big sci-fi fans I mean but this moment right here when it peels through the wall in this giant T-1000 looking skull and the laser the laser eyes come out at you I mean it's just like at this point you're just like what the hell is going on but it's awesome Oh, and that. We were definitely not, had no idea that was about to happen. And me and my cousin would always uh, toss up bets who, who was going to get attacked first every time uh, this this part of the game comes up. Oh, the biker stage. At, at this point, we thought we had pretty much beat the stage. We weren't sure what was up next. And then all, out of nowhere, this helicopter comes, and the arrow points up, and we're like, nah, are you kidding? <laughs> and it just takes you up into the air. I mean, we had never played a game like this, so we were just tripping the whole time. But, you know, it didn't matter how hard the game was. It, it was still fun. I mean, I miss that about a lot of games now. They games like this when they come out they know how to balance fun with how hard the game is and again this part I mean you get on this helicopter you you get flown way up thousands of feet in the air and then then all of a sudden we were like what we're gonna be jumping from missile to missile defeating this giant we don't we had no I mean I don't know what to call that I mean just the arguments the yelling the the holy shit moments back then <laughs> Again, your character is so badass, he doesn't even get back into the helicopter. He just fucking hangs on the missile. I like this part of the game because it was very much a homage to the first one. The game where you could actually use the cheat code to get 30 lives. So, Keep in mind, we were playing this. We were like 9 and 10 years old. So to beat this on hard back then, I mean... <laughs> Uh, this creature that came out of the ground just freaked us out. Half, like, I don't know, this thing mated with a human or something or whatever, but on hard, this was very difficult, even on two player for us at the time. But it was just epic, man. Everything, everything about this game kept reminding us of, you know, Terminator 2 aliens, Starship Troopers, or, you know. Well, I don't know that that movie actually wasn't out around that time. Just Aliens and Terminator 2. 
that's what we in Predator. We kept thinking of those uh, sci-fi uh, flicks every time we played this game. Again, this fantastical creature right here, another awesome moment. Just this is just like a little mini mini boss, but it's just awesome. Of course, you get up here, you get the... This is very much like a homage to the first one as well. So I think this is the third stage on the first one. There's a similar boss. Well, actually, in the first one, many bosses are like this. But Again, we knew at this point that that wasn't going to be the, the final boss. It was hard enough as it, as it was back then. Beating this on hard to get the, the manly ending. <laughs> Obviously, the weapon of choice was always the cluster. The cluster, the homing, and then, uh... The spread. Now, right here, after you beat Mother Brain, which is another epic battle, this was, like, another one of those, holy shit, this game is just epic moments. You think you've won. Of course, you have to ride out in the most manliest style on the missile of the helicopter but then as as you thought it was over no 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 you don't you don't get out that easy I mean that that's just epic man <laughs> these moments right here made the game just so memorable for me and my cousin to this day we play this game it's like a ritual whenever we have family get togethers we're gonna play this game awesome game. Well, those are my favorite moments, guys. My favorite moments of Contra 3 Alien Wars.